Okay. So um so what you're looking at here is is the code that is used to um that I've sent down to the Arduino. So uh you can see there that um I've initialized a couple of potentiometers or a couple of variables any anyway, I'm gonna use and also another couple of variables, quantity and length. And then um this is the main body of the code. So basically what it does is um, the first couple of lines there, uh, quantity equals and length equals, um, reads the analog value of the potentiometer. And then um, the lines below that, basically um, what they do is print to the LCD the value of the, um, the analog value, the digital analog value of the pot and, um, and the words quantity and length. And so over here, This is it. This is working now. So um, I'm not plugged into the PC anymore. So uh, all I've got here is some power in, and that's the USB port. But you can see it's not plugged into anything. And then if I show you the the pots, so I've got a couple of input pots. Um, I don't know which is which and hold the camera steady. So there's this one which will control the quantity. So you see it's actually going up. Yeah, so um so you gave me an example three hundred and forty five. So we can so how close I can get that. That's actually saying 345 now, and then um, and then the length it's going up as well. So you gave me an example length, I think of 16. It's going to be quite hard to get, especially with one hand. There we go. Nearly. Sixteen. Yeah, it's hovering, isn't it? Sixteen. So um the next plan there then is to have a, a go button. And when you press go, um the quantity value that I've stored somewhere in a variable will count down. So and when it reaches zero it'll stop. Or maybe it'll pick a different length <laughs> um, or maybe a different carousel with a different width webbing on it anyway there we go uh, today's woohoo